The woman who walked a man up a London street on a dog lead says the display was a theatrical project and not a PR stunt. The odd couple sparked an internet frenzy last Friday, April the 11th, when bemused passers-by saw the man crawling on all fours in Farringdon. Twitter was flooded with users posting pictures and video footage of the pair using the hashtag hashzimanunleash. Eden Avital Alexander, who has worked as an actress for 20 years, today approached the standard to say she was the woman behind the stunt. The man on the lead is the director of the project, who wants to remain anonymous until the piece goes live. She said the idea was to create art by filming reactions to the man being taken for walkies. A hidden camera was put in a tissue box and carried by a woman walking alongside them, but as soon as people began filming the camera operator joined the crowds. Many speculated the pair were part of a PR stunt and mock-up pictures of the pair advertising cleaning products emerged. Miss Alexander, who lives in East London, said, It was not a BDSM or a PR stunt. The project seemed at the start like a funny thing to be a part of and was all about the audience, which for me I think is the most important part of acting. I believe that artists, actors especially, should take the audience out of their normal everyday life and make them think and feel other things, in this case was to make them laugh, but while doing it different things came up, though I definitely found the cleaning product commercial and the job center commercial very amusing. She said some members of the public approached her and one passerby even began a debate on human rights. The 27-year-old said a final video piece is currently being edited and will focus on the reactions of the public. Since last Friday pictures of the actors traveled as far as France, Eastern Europe and the US, with global newspapers printing their picture. Ms. Alexander moved to London from Israel three years ago and has starred in several plays, including productions at Camden's The Lord Stanley and Battersea Arc Centre.